Hello everyone, welcome back to my making of for misfortune part three. If you missed the first two videos, we put the links down in the description so you can check those out if you want to get caught up. In this video, I'll show you how I made her guns. I had a ton of fun making these, so I hope you guys enjoy seeing the process. So let's go. I really like the oversized Nintendo Zapper Light guns seen in the splash art that were originally in the game before being changed to what she has now, so that's what I made. I started by 3D modeling them in Blender, then printing out all the pieces. It took around 80 hours to print both guns. Contrary to what a lot of people think, 3D printed parts aren't completely finished when they come off the printer. If you want a smooth surface, you have to get rid of the layer striations. Now, there are a few ways to do this, but I use sandpaper and elbow grease. I usually start with 100 grit sandpaper and work up to 220 grit. Using a power sander on large flat parts definitely helps things go faster. I used ABS glue made from 3D print scraps to glue everything together and filled any gaps with Bondo. After all the joints and seams were sanded smooth, I sprayed both guns with filler primer. Once primed, I used this stuff to fill any remaining imperfections. Then did a final sanding, starting with 300 grit and working up to 600. Now for my favorite part, painting. I first put down a white base coat, then masked everything for the first color. I used all pearlized paints from Creotex. First up, silver. And I mixed a darker shade for the details. Then I just worked through the colors, masking off each part individually. Unmasking is always so exciting. Last of all, I sealed everything with gloss clear coat. And they're finished. And that is it. I am so happy with how these turned out and so excited to be finished with the whole costume. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and this series. I hope it was helpful in some way. If so, please leave a thumbs up. It really does help. And until next time, 